everybody, welcome to a new video. I want to say favourite time of year because it's the start of my favourite time of year. I love Halloween, bonfire night and Christmas. They, this like three month period is my favourite, favourite time of the year. And to celebrate that and start that off, we always love to do things and we love to go um, pumpkin picking and all sorts like that. But I thought because we're in this silly little lockdown thing that is happening right now, it's very much needed so please all do stay safe. We're all missing the parks right now and none of us can get there really um, to celebrate Halloween in the amazing Disney fashion. So I thought I would show you my favourite things to do, Disney Halloween at home. So I separated them into three categories um, which are make, watch and bake. So I've got two things that I have made. So the first thing I made actually last year, so I thought I would whip it in here, a like clip of the video that I made. up here now on my wall in the living room I absolutely love it okay thing number two so you do have to somewhat leave the house for this is to make Disney carved pumpkins so we love carving pumpkins like I said we love going to pumpkin patches we've been doing it for the three years we've been together we've been going once a year with the Tom's family and we just absolutely love it. The first year we actually didn't go and pick the pumpkins from there. We get them from Morrison's and because they're a little bit cheaper and they're like rounder, um, which is easier to carve out. But we love doing this. So I'll pop in a picture of our first pumpkins we ever did. I love these Cheshire Cat. My, I will never beat that Cheshire Cat that I made. Um, and the second year I did a Deathly Hallows. And then last year was the best. It was our first pumpkins in our in this house, and we actually filmed carving them. So I'll pop in a little clip here. All right, guys, what do we think? Can you see it? Can you tell what it is? got our pumpkins to carve yet this year so pop down in the comments what you think we should carve for Halloween this year. Disney ideas, I don't know what I'm gonna pick. Tom do you have any ideas what you think you're gonna do for your Disney pumpkin this year? Not yet. Not yet? I'm not too sure. But yeah so pop down in the comments what you think that we should make this year for our Disney pumpkins. Okay on to the third thing. Uh, this I haven't finished yet. I want to make a Mickey pumpkin like decoration thing that they have in the parks at Halloween um, and I thought I'd give it a go <laughs> so I've half made it so far I thought I'd finish it with Tom um, so I'm gonna put in the clips here before of how I decided to make the body aspect to start with
I have made two heads. This one's drying pretty well. This one's just flat. And then this one, I don't know if you can see, but I put like ridges in it. Oh, you can just about see. Okay, so we don't need ears like that. <laughs> So what I'm thinking is I'm going to put the one with the ridges over the one that's flat and then cut the one with the ridges so that it goes through and then I'll paint the one underneath yellow, if that makes sense. I haven't quite finished the Mickey pumpkin yet and it is about the end of the video but all I'm thinking of doing is rounding the ears off a little bit more and chopping off the unpainted newspaper and then sticking it all together. I haven't got any more of the orange leaves that I used on my Dreamcatcher wreath because I got those last year and I can't seem to find any this year so yeah I might have to find them elsewhere for next year to display the Mickey head. Um, but yeah I hope you enjoyed following it along and it's inspired you to try and make your own uh, but anyway on to the next category okay on to category two which is bake um, so me and Tom literally any time that we possibly can make Rice Krispie treats we're, we're gonna make Rice Krispie treats <laughs> uh, so what I want to do is make the little Mickeys as usual but then make them look like the Mickey pumpkins so kind of tying into the make that we did um but yeah so i'm going to melt three bars of white chocolate there's yeah. already two in here Oy. so i'm gonna add one more into there i'm gonna eat then fine really yeah thank you <laughs> uh, three bars of white chocolate packet of marshmallows they didn't have any white ones that's okay packet of marshmallows on the hub some hot water and then once it's all melted, mix in enough Rice Krispies that I think is enough. Plop it in a um, like baking Top. tray or whatever and then put it in the fridge to cool. And then once they're cool, we all cut out the Mickeys and ice them. We need so to make them orange. Yeah, so that's what the other two bars of white chocolate is for because I want to white, uh, melt it to make white chocolate orange for the pumpkins. to the watch section. Uh, so these things are all like different Halloween-y things that you can watch at home. So obviously normally I'd be like you can go to the cinema and watch things at the cinema and you can go out and most places have like outdoor cinemas and things at this time of year but not really accessible at the moment. Cinemas, I do want to say, are very, very, very accessible at the moment. Most of them are having to close because nobody is going, but they are one of the places that are doing the best they can to make places uh, and people feel safe within the cinema. So if you do have an independent or local cinema, please do check them out because they need this money and support at the moment. 
Um, but anyway, the first thing that I want to say that you can watch is on YouTube, and it is, of course, Disney vlogs. We all love Disney vlogs. Me and Tom watch them on a weekly basis. <laughs> yeah, around a weekly basis, we watch another load of Disney vlogs. Um, and we have watched so many, but Halloween is obviously a time that everybody loves and we really really want to go at Halloween like it looks really fun doesn't it like with Mickey's not so scary and all of the different things that you can do throughout the Halloween period so we are going to now have some lunch I've got our Rice Krispie treats and we are going to watch Who Do You Fancy? Yeah so you can watch Walt Disney World and obviously Paris do their different things at Halloween as well and there's Disneyland as well and different things um, and Tokyo and all sorts, you can watch things from everywhere, all the parks do them. We've just what typed in... Awesome. Yeah, we've just typed in Disney World Halloween vlog. I would have put October, but never mind. Um, and there's Tim Tracker. These are all people that we have watched previously. Um, Disney in Detail, Adam Hatton, uh, Tim Tracker again. And then there are people like Eleanor Dreaming, which you can find. And then all of our other favourites haven't actually been Octo in October time yet. So, maybe one day. <laughs> oh, and Lisa Priest, we've watched all of hers as well. Most of these we've watched before, so we might have to re-watch one of our favourites. Oh, and Charlotte Ruff as well, she's been at Halloween quite a few times, and I presume Brogan Tate has also been at Halloween. They're also really good ones if you're looking for new people to watch. Oh, we've never watched Yaz and Ash go at Halloween. Should we watch Yaz and Ash go at Halloween? Yeah. Yeah, so Yaz and Ash are a really good vlog as well. They have a merch line called Magical Day Apparel uh, and then they obviously vlog all of their trips and wear all their clothes on their trips. <laughs> we're in the blanket mm. but then number two on the watch list mm. is on YouTube again but YouTube. it's the Disney Parks YouTube channel so we love the Disney Parks YouTube channel don't we yeah um, when we did our Disney days at home we watched the ride point of views on here yeah. and they upload so many different things like that well I don't know if it was there before but when lockdown happened and stuff they seem to um, do lots of um watch this show yeah so the number two is watch all the halloween things on disney parks they've got some shows they've got it's time to check in at the twilight zone tower of terror so i'm guessing that's tower of terror point of view and then they've got this one i've just seen is hit up the most haunted places in ha and magic kingdom so mm. i will show you what it looks like so this is the disney parks youtube channel and then they've got all sorts so Look at that one, Doug's offering tail wagging. Look at the new Halloween fashions. Let's see what this is. Yes. <laughs> For filming. Halloween Netflix. fashion. <laughs> Trick or treat with pets. <laughs> but anyway, these are the next two we're gonna watch: is the Twilight Zone, Tower of Terror, and hit up the most haunted places in Magic Kingdom. And they don't just have Walt Disney World; it's like Disney Park. So Disneyland stuff is on here too. So that Pirates of the Caribbean is from. Disneyland and then there's all ride point of views from Disneyland rides as well which is really cool but yeah so definitely definitely check out Disney Parks YouTube channel okay and then the last Disney vlog thing you can do is people upload full HD um, all of the parades so in one video so you could watch uh, Mickey's Boo to You Halloween Parade from Walt Disney World there's the um, what's the Hocus Pocus show called Villain Spectacular um, fireworks show not so spooky spectacular um, fireworks show there's all the Disneyland Paris things the oh, what's the Disneyland Paris one called I can't remember what it's called but Disneyland Paris Halloween things uh, all the cavalcades from this year, people have already uploaded all of those. Um, yeah, there's so many from all of the years as well. Like when we get bored, just in normal times, we go back and watch old 
firework shows like Wishes and different things like that and things in Disneyland Paris like World of Colour and the Magic Happens Parade. Yeah, so many. So yeah, definitely watch some of the parades and firework shows. and it's the last thing we're gonna do with our day. Let's watch a Halloween Disney movie. <laughs> so we've already watched Hocus Pocus and we've already watched Halloween Town, uh, but on Disney Plus they have this little section for Halloween. I'll show you. So it's this little Halloween section. Um, it's in like the top tab of the home page, but we're not too sure what to watch. <laughs> So we've got ourselves a really good Halloween feast and we've put on Can you guess? Woo! We got the little candle on and we've got snacks. Got some little sweets. Halloween Cadbury pumpkin cakes, they're just chocolate cakes with little pumpkins on. Our Rice Krispie treats and some little Halloween like chocolates. Yum yum. With a cup of tea and a blanket. <laughs> and that is everything. <laughs> so yeah, I really hope you enjoyed my seven things to do over the Halloween period. Um, I love doing all of these and I love making new crafts, I love baking new things. I wish I'd done more bakes, I just haven't had more time. I was going to make some cheesecakes. I once made the same way I paper mache the Mickey head with balloons. I've done that with white chocolate before and then filled it with cheesecake and stuck a flake out the top so they look like little pumpkins and that would have been so fun to do. Um, and also cookies are so easy to do and then decorate and there's all sorts like cupcakes you can make Oreos make great Mickey ears and you could always dip those in orange white chocolate too and make little pumpkin like frosted cupcakes and yeah anything like that is amazing let your creativity go wild <laughs> uh, but yeah let me know down in the comments if you have any crafts or bakes or watching things that you <laughs> watching things that you have been doing over the October half term or October season or that you're planning on doing on the run up to Halloween let me know down in the comments because I would love to see and hear all of those and also tag me on Instagram send me some messages pictures anything do go give me a follow down on Instagram uh, but yeah thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video bye